Okay, folks, how you doing? This is Brent LaRondell. I'm making another workout video, and I know it's been a while since I've made one, but uh, don't you worry. I've still been working out. I've been keeping up the habit. Uh, I got even better at my routine, in my opinion. But uh, the main reason why I took a break was because all the setting up and recording, especially as an amateur, not really knowing what to do or how to do it, took a lot of time and focus out of my workouts. So um, with all the time off, I was able to focus on my routine and do a better job at doing workouts that I'm actually comfortable doing and I'm proud to do. Um, some workouts were just... I was doing workouts from some people that would recommend them, but when I would do them, they wouldn't feel correct or feel right. So, you know, it's a lot of trial and error. Um, I mainly started working out way back in 2019, and then that was kind of like bought dumbbells and worked out whenever I was feeling like testosterone, I guess. But, uh... It wasn't until like 2021, 2022, when I started actually trying to keep track of my calories and uh, trying to diet and work out. I've been lacking on the dieting part, but I have been doing a lot of the working out. And I'm, hope I'm hoping it balances itself out eventually. I'm hoping eventually my metabolism builds up to the point where I'm going to start burning fat, even when I'm resting. That's what the science says it's supposed to happen, and so I just am going to keep working out, and I'm going to sit back, and I'm going to wait. So anyways, um, I got back into recording my workouts because the main reason I want to keep doing this recording my workouts is because I want to be a role model for indigenous youth, or men, or just people who like what like seeing me do what I do and want to be or want to do the same stuff. Some of you might be wondering why I work out with a timer around my neck. Um, I use it to make sure that I don't rest for too long and that I don't rest for too short. So two minutes is like the perfect time for resting from what I hear. And so sometimes if you're resting, you don't really pay attention. You go over that two minutes and you lose a lot of potential uh, uh, calorie burns. I don't know. You can't let your blood pressure get too low. You know, you got to keep your blood, um, your heart rate high. Yeah, heart rate. So yeah, that's why I have my timer around my neck and if any of you are wondering why I have a dirty mirror and why it's always dirty every time I work out it's because my daughter is two years old and she just loves looking at herself so there's lip marks all over the mirror there's hand marks I even found a foot mark out of nowhere I don't even know where that came from or she's just like fucking karate kicking the mirror I don't know. I just want to say too that this workout that I did today, I mean during this video, um, really got my hamstrings very sore. It was a very good hamstring exercise. That's what I wanted to work out and I'm happy that that's what's sore. Um, next leg day I'm going to be doing some squats and that's going to be working out my quads more than my hamstrings. But yeah. I've been very exhausted the last couple days because, well, I mean, I don't mean to bitch about stuff, but I've been sore from my workouts, which means I'm doing a good job, I guess. Um, so, yay. Thank goodness I'm sore, I guess. <laughs> so what I've been doing lately is I've been teaching dance at Head Start. I've been teaching Head Start kids, kindergarten kids, and grade one kids how to Métis dance, and it's been going pretty well. I've been trying to reach out to other schools to include the program into their like 
schedules, but um, I think the main problem that I have is I don't record and post a lot of the stuff that I do with the kids because I'm a really good teacher and the kids really learn a lot and they enjoy having me there. The teachers love having me there. I mean, it's not cheap, my program that I offer the schools, but the teacher just loves having the program. So she's willing to pay for it. And so I don't know if I wanted to reach out to other schools, I should use that teacher as a reference. But I also need to post more pictures and videos, which is kind of a complicated area because you got to use like VoIP forms and uh, make sure that everyone signs a waiver or some type of thing. So if any of you guys are watching, any of you guys are listening, this has been my workout vlog slash workout podcast. I don't know, but I'm going to keep trying to do voiceovers instead of using background music until I decide to change it up again. We'll see. Anyways, hope you guys are having a good day. Don't forget to like and subscribe or follow or whatever. You know, love you guys. Have a good day. Proud of all your achievements. I hope you're proud of mine. Peace.